We'll guide you through how to fix your MacBook not charging. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So you may find that your MacBook is completely out of battery and it won't go and charge, or it may have some battery, but it still won't go and charge. And when you go and plug it in, you may find that the light comes on here if you've got a MagSafe charger, or it may remain gray, or if you've got a USB, of course, you can't go and tell there. So let's go and get started. So if your MacBook currently has some charge, then it's worth trying to restart it. Of course, if it doesn't, you can't go and do this. But to do this, click on the Apple icon in the top right and then click on Restart and go and see after that if it will go and charge. If it still isn't or your MacBook's out of charge anyway, then let's get into the next fix. What you want to do is go and make sure that there's no debris or dust or just grime, which is in the charging port, which could be preventing the connection. So I've got a MagSafe charger here, so I can see that there. But if you're using a USB-C port, do the same thing. Of course, it's worth try using a different port if you can, but of course, not everybody has that option. Use a cotton bud and go and clean it off. And of course, go and check the actual cable itself as well. That's a really common problem. After you've cleaned it, see if the problem is now fixed. If it still isn't, then it may be a faulty charger. So what you can try doing is going and using a different charger. For example, if you've got a MagSafe cable, try using a USB-C cable and you can plug it into a different port, of course. If your MacBook is USB-C anyway, then what you could try doing is using a different cable and a different port. And that may be the solution to your problem. Now, if you've got an Intel-based Mac, which is one of the older ones, which uses an Intel-based chip, what you can do is do something called reset the SMC. So you can try doing that. I have actually got an SMC Mac, so I can't do it. But yeah, you can go and research that if you have one. I hope one of the methods in this video has solved your problem. If it did, please leave a like.